Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. The Document Views buttons are a group of four or five buttons located at the left end of the horizontal scroll bar. You can switch amongst the different views of your document here. You can choose Normal View, Web Layout View, which was called Online Layout if you're using the 97. We have also the Print Layout View, and in 97 that was called Page Layout. You also have an Outline View. And in 2003, we also have a reading layout view, which simply lays multiple pages next to each other. You can also change your views by using the commands at the top section of the View menu dropdown. Normal view is for standard document creation. It's the default view and the one some users prefer because it offers a larger screen than some of the other views. Its major drawback, as you can see, is that it tends to slightly misrepresent the way that the document will look when printed. The reason being is that you cannot see any margins in this view. Well, we can see the right margin, but you do not see your top margin and you do not see your left margin. So things might look differently when printed if you use this view. The web layout or online layout is the view used for creating web pages with the Word program. However, our recommended view is the print layout view, or it was called page layout if using 97. In this view, you'll say, see the way that the document will actually look when you print it. You can see all of your margins in this view. So here we can see the top margin, the left margin, the right and the bottom. The outline view is used to help you organize hierarchy of ideas in an outline or agenda. And other than really creating that specific type, we don't tend to use it very often. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.